Hey folks, this is Mark with OrientWatchUSA.com and this is the Starfish EM7J 00BB. Now this particular variation is with a black face as well uh, as the Arabic. We have one other variation I believe that doesn't use the Arabic 12 and 6. This is a 50 meter case, so you can always, um, it, will, it will be workable just about any sort of daily activity that you may have. Uh, one very nice thing about this watch is that it's fully mechanical. Now, I'm going to explain that uh, much more in detail in a little bit, but what I want you to understand is that what, we're, what you're looking at is a true old school watch where you actually have to, uh, where you have to wind it. So. Um, it's got well, that really nice retro uh, technology in there that everyone's looking for. Um, take a look at the dial, you'll notice that the hands as well as the hour indices are luminous. And the functionality of this movement is day and date. Okay, let's take a look at the leather band and you'll notice that it uses this nice uh, leather. Uh, it's black, it's got this nice black stitching on the side. So uh, it looks very uh, reasonable to, uh, with the very uh, kind of spoiled design of the, of the dial. All right. Uh, as I mentioned, this is a mechanical watch, and if you take a look at the back of your uh, of your watch, you'll see an exhibition case back, which means there's a piece of glass that exposes your mechanism. Now let's take a little closer look at that mechanism, and you'll notice that there are absolutely no batteries. This is uh, this design is from the old, uh, is from when our grandparents were still around, folks. Okay. So just so you know, this is how you adjust the watch. Use the crown, let's pull to this first position, and we can adjust uh, uh, date and day. Okay, let me move the hand out the way. Okay, now going back to the first position, I can adjust the date, as you can see right there. Now to adjust the day, which you can see around the nine o'clock position, we use a two o'clock push button. You see how it goes to Spanish to English? Once you set it to the language of your preference, it remains in it. Okay, that's something that you have to know. Now, just so you know, the the, the uh, 469 caliber works like this. When it progresses through the time, and at midnight, the date goes, as you saw, at 1.30, it's, it goes through one pivot, and at 3.20, it goes to the second pivot. Now, why do we do that? It's because Orient Watch is an international company, and in some countries, you uh, they speak more than one language, or in some, in some regions, and so, uh, that's why that type of technology is used with the Orient watches. Alright folks, I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope to see you wearing this Stingray very soon.